Even if I lost today, your attempts are in vain. We're doomed to eternal confrontation. Probably it's a roguelike. That's the point. Welcome back, everybody, to TD Worlds, where last episode, we were so close to our first W. Now, I've been thinking about it, and where I think I went wrong is I kind of got greedy and took an, an extra one of them uh, big power-ups, and it dropped down my damage that I did two towers, and I couldn't recover from that. So this time around, if given the option for another, or given an option for, like, two of those big upgrades, actually, I think it was the third one that messed us up, I'm probably going to turn it down. So I did get um, hill-shielded enemies, so that gave us... Uh, what did that give us? That gave us 15% uh, damage to shields. Now we're going to work on killing basic enemies. Anything else? No, I think that's good. Oh, um, scavenge thing. Okay, yeah, he's just telling me what I already know. The armory, I was thinking about taking one of these, but I f one of these uh, upgrades, but I think I'm just going to hold on to it for right now. And the shop. Can I get anything for six? And no, so we're, uh, all right, new run, let's go. And if you guys want to see me play any other games, uh, if you guys want to see me play any other games, please, you know, let me know down in the comments below. Um, you know, if it's uh, like a $20 and under game, I can usually just quick buy that. If it's a more expensive game, I might have to do just a little bit of budgeting, just a bit. And I put on the, uh, I put on the little ninja hat here. All right, where were we? All right, towers, yes. And what is it? R to go fast. <coughs> Excuse me, my, uh, throat's been particularly dry the last couple days. But I'm super proud of myself, so I, I had some weight gain over the holidays and over the last year, and I, uh, I basically made it my mission this year to not drink soda during the weekdays. And, uh, so I've basically just been pounding nothing but water, because I have a nasty habit of if there's a drink in front of me, I will consume it, like, unrelentingly. So I just make sure I keep, uh, water in front of me. Uh, let's see here. Do I take a shield? Or do I take a cost? You know, the, the difference between, like, the, uh, the, it doesn't seem like the, the cost I will take an uncommon, because it doesn't seem like it gets that much better if I, to, uh, if I do a, a higher rarity version. Uh, so coming here, piece of cake. So I'm, I'm really liking, I'm really liking this game, like, a lot, uh. So far, this is probably my favorite game of the year so far. I wish progress in it was just a little easier, but you know what? It's still a new game. Still has some balancing stuff to work through. But I'm, I'm having a blast playing it. I love this game to death. The uh, firepower. Fire rate. I'll take. Oh, hey, uh, like an actual one of the upgrade things. Okay. What I look for when I place down towers is how much of the path they're going to cover. I, I really like to put uh, towers down on, like, corners. Because a corner will cover a lot of space. And now I'm kind of regretting taking that uncommon uh, cost deck... Uh, that uh, uncommon cost, because uh, it's, yeah, it may be 5%, but it's, I'm only getting like a 1% decrease in cost, and that's not a lot. But I kind of, I kind of messed that up there a lot. But that's okay, you know, live and learn. Do you need more projectile speed, though? Oh yeah, this. I'm looking for chain damage. What's this one? Burning? Uh, shoot. I'm taking the common chain damage. It's at least something. 
Uh, another tower upgrade. I'd... God, this level. Okay. Uh, they'll come from here first. Alright, now they're coming from here. I will reclaim that slot. Alright, so they're coming from here again. Uh, can I reclaim this one? Yes, I can. Uh, fill in a couple of spots here. And I would like to grab you. Uh, next one, they're coming here, so they'll have to pass through this section of the map, so let's build up this one as well. Alright, I think we got this all under control now. I'm pretty sure they come from any everywhere. Ooh, I'm... Projectile speed is failing me. Alright, took a little damage, but... Ah, oh, nothing too terrible. Uh, what do we got? Fire rate, that's pretty good. Tower cost, meh, firepower. A legendary firepower. Oh, of course I say I don't need the money and there's a shop. We're skipping the shop. We're saving up. Uh, gracious, I think they come from here first? Nope, from there. From both sides first, okay. So I I really I'm really enjoying this game. And I really hope that the little hats and th and things actually do something cuz the hats are kind of cool. Oh yeah. Jerks. Although I do have some chain damage, so maybe I do have some chain damage, so it's fine. I think chain damage is probably my favorite. Is probably my favorite upgrade so far. Ooh, some more of these uh, scraps of antimatter. Hell yeah. That's 25% shield damage, but I'm already inherently dealing a bunch. Oh, wait. I need to build. Completely under control. Everything is fine. What's a tower cost to me these days? 95, okay. Yep, now the shielded bastards are coming. And not even a problem. Look at that. We have a stout defensive line here. That was good for a, for a bunch. I do get a lot of bonuses for... Uh, that's what I'm looking for. I do get a lot of bonuses in shield damage right now. Because of all of my uh, researches that I put forth. I think uh, shield damage was like the first thing I wanted done. Because shielded enemies have messed me up too many times. And I'm hoping that we can do the same thing with these normal enemies. We've already killed 505, so we're getting, we're finishing up that research here. And gone. And upgrade time. What do we got? Ooh, a rare projectile speed. So what is our projectile speed? Minus 60? Yeah, we definitely need that. Ooh. So I have a decision to make here. So I messed up this run early by taking an uncommon chain damage, which isn't going to help me long term. I think that will end up killing me. So this could be a pivotal moment. Either I could get a tower upgrade 
Either I could bank on this chain damage killing me early on in the run, and I can make some meta progress for the long term, or I can just take a tower upgrade and try and make it as far as I possibly can. As of right now, there is no reason for me to... I lose nothing if this run ends early. I didn't spend those uh, the red currency stuff on a big tower upgrade. I've already completed my research for this level. So if I die, I will lose nothing. This will just be a shorter run. Or if I advance... The way I'm justifying it to myself is I lose nothing if this run fails. I'm going to take the meta progress. Let's speed things up here. Things moving, keep her moving, let's go. Oh my gosh, that uh, projectile speed is so good. So much projectile speed. I also think I kind of messed up by taking the uh, uncommon uh, upgrade for the uh, elf, for the uh, cost of towers. I think that one's going to come back to bite me here. But the projectile speed, baby, coming in clutch. That's another two. And a shop already. So here, I can pretty much buy everything. Oh, nice to see you. I hope my goods will interest you. Yes, I will take the tower upgrade. For a air fire rate or a legendary shield damage? I think I'll take the legendary shield damage. I'll take the extra uh, money and the heal. The results will always be the same. Yes, me kicking your ass. No, we cannot change the future, but I am liking this stylish headband. Oh, he's starting off with shield guys. I am really happy that I took that shield upgrade, or that sh extra shield damage. And now he's got the fast guys. I'm very happy I took that projectile speed. Holding down the speed up button here. Yet. There we go. Alright, so now I'm dealing damage to that guy. Everything's coming up, uh, coming up Millhouse. There we go. So now let's just kind of chill, let things happen at this rate. Either the enemies win or I do. I can't build any more towers. And I'm thinking I'm going to win here. Even if I lost today, your attempts are in vain. We're doomed to eternal confrontation. Probably it's a roguelike. That's the point. Now this cannot be changed. No, it can't. I've beaten this guy a lot. Definitely the headband of power here. And another one of them things. Ugh. I just got an achievement. It's not blind luck. Probably because I've beaten this first guy so much. Ugh. I cannot be stopped. I don't remember there being dialogue. I cannot be stopped. I think that's new. But whatever, it's fine. It's fine if it's new. So what am I looking for on this level? Um, I think the big one I'm looking for as of right now is more firepower. Firepower and I think projectile speed are the two I'm looking for right now. 
But if I'm offered a good radius upgrade, I won't, I don't think I'll turn it down. Although shield damage might not go amiss. I'm not dealing, no, I think I will take, so let's see here, 15% from research, 18, what is that? That is 33. So I'm uh, 33, 7%. Uh, I'm basically only increasing my shield damage by 7%. So that's the upgrade. I'm pro the big immediate upgrade. If I get that, we're golden. Oh, man, I kind of regret not taking a better tower upgrade. We do eventually get the ability to reroll abilities. We get the ability to reroll abilities. So I know I'm looking for that one. Uh, no advantage should be neglected. No, it should not. Uh, fire rate, firepower, exactly what I was looking for. Or one of the things I was looking for. This next shop is going to be very impactful. Yeah. Yeah! Nothing. Nothing. Not even a problem. Okay, maybe a little problem. I'm sweating a little. But nothing. I wish those levels didn't happen so fast. Yeah, look at that. Okay. Maybe if I take this, I can get an upgrade to the chain damage. Chain it to one more tower. I don't want to do this. Uh, that's These are good spots right here. That's an okay spot. Oh, those are big guys. But it might not be a problem. Doesn't look like it is. I think we're okay. Uh, yeah, not even, not a problem. This next shot, man, I have 200 some odd essence. It's gonna be potent. Oh no. Oh no. Fire rate? Well, what's my fire rate? Oh yeah, I can take the hit on fire rate. Projectile speed is already too slow. I can't afford to take that hit. No, let me collect my essence, thank you. Come on. Oh, it won't let me collect that. Ooh, shop. The impactful shop. Uh, oh, uh, we meet again. Ooh, it's the star lady. Maybe she'll give me a good upgrade. Yeah, oh, free upgrade. I hope it's something good. Give me something good, baby. Come on, where's the star? Where is it? There you are. Ooh, 15% fire rate? Wait a second. The explode on death thing took away some of our fire rate, didn't it? Yeah, so that helps make up for some of that. Legendary shield damage, legendary firepower. Legendary shield damage I'm gonna take. Scraps of antimatter and extra life. This was a very impactful shop. Wait a second. Which one did I take? Uh, oh, I took area damage. Oh, the area chain damage combo. This is what the developers recommended as a, as a combination to use. Very happy. I inadvertently took that. I didn't even notice that. Is it thundering? I think I hear it thundering. Yeah, it's definitely thundering. 10 out of 10 sound design. Okay. More firepower, more fire rate. Oh, 
I'm going to take fire rate on this one. Because of that. Whoa. I've done this one before. Anyways, I'm going to take... I'm going to take fire rate to make up for the AoE thing. Wow, I've just, like, placed an entire arsenal of towers here in, like, no time flat. Fantastic! Oh, that was easy. More scraps! Uh... Shoot, this run's lasting longer than I thought it would. We'll take the tower upgrade. Okay, so... this direction first. So then is stuff gonna start coming from this way or is this a red herring? I'm gonna place one just in case I miss it. Nope, it was not a red herring. Things were actually coming from there. Oh my god, I just realized that in Scoop and what in uh, a pup named Scooby Doo, the villain that Fred Jones always accused was Red Herring. Ah. Figures. Ooh, projectile speed. Hell yeah. Ooh, a shop. Oh, long time no see. Yes, yes, thank you. I'm sorry, I was only able to return uh, one of your pets. I, I know, my bad. I'm gonna take the tower upgrade, and I'm gonna give myself more. Firepower. It's manly! I would like a radius upgrade at some point. I will stop you, madman? Wait. Am I the villain? I might be the villain in this situation. What is my firepower upgrade? I'll check my firepower upgrade later. I need to focus. This is intense. Like camping. But I'm Tiss. AoE upgrade coming in clutch, as the youth would say. So, drop that there, I think. Looking for a tower upgrade there, and I would like... want to make sure that we're doing okay there. Save up my money. Because of course he's going to swap spots. And now at this point, I think he's entering into his final phase. He's over here. Let's just secure myself real quick. And I can't build anymore, unfortunately. So now we just got to wait. And I'm doing so much damage to him, it doesn't even matter. How could I lose, even if you passed by me again? This is not our last meeting, no, because it's a roguelike, and it's never supposed to be our last meeting. The world is cleared. I'm a hero. I need to act. Yes. Darkness recedes, and I go after it. Okay. What am I doing for firepower? So I've got 86 from that. I've got... 30 from that, so 86, 30, what is that, 116? Doing 116% damage. Should lean into it, just maximum firepower. When I hit, you feel it. I would love a radius upgrade, though. Like, really like a radius upgrade. The last one in line. Yes, we're already on to World 3, and it's only 24 minutes. I think this is a, a new record for me for a speed run. But I kind of get the gist of this game now. I kind of get the gameplay loop of this thing now. Dead World, Ice Continent.
Russia with love. I don't know why I said that. Is that a James Bond movie? I don't even watch James Bond. I'm thinking about James Bond. Oh, speaking of which, we're done. Power upgrades. Ooh, a common radius. I think I can do better. Ooh. Big firepower, though. Big firepower, more gooder. Oh, they'll definitely be coming through here. Alright, I think we got this. Yes, another tower there, please. And one more here. On the off chance, things actually sneak through. Dude, this is... We do so much damage. 23% damage. Power cost improvement, projectile speed, fire rate. I'm going to take the projectile speed just to make sure none of those uh, little guys sneak by us. Yeah, now, we've, now we actually have a shot here at hitting the little guys. I think enemies come up from here, so I'm just going to bury my defenses deep in here and all are good. I would like to build one there, though. Yeah. Nothing's getting through. I think I've got too much damage at this point. So I'm no longer taking any more of these special upgrades. Just because that's what messed me up last time. I've got two, and this is no time to get greedy. Alright. Ooh, radius. Exactly what I was looking for. Plus 19%. Because this next shot could be critical, I'm going to take uh, this extra currency here. Oh, look at that radius increase. My god, it's beautiful. There we go. Yeah, the chain AoE is just immaculate. The dev was right. Chain AoE to victory, baby. Oh. Should not have taken that particular cost, though. That particular cost upgrade, though. That was a bad call by me. And one I thought would be punishing me a lot more than it actually did. I don't know. That brings me up to a cool 123. Not yet. I'm going to skip this shop. I'm going to go I'm going to hit the next one. Uh, everything's going to be filtering through here basically, so defense there, defense there, defense there and ooh, are those big guys? That problematic for me? I don't know yet. Do I have enough AoE? I don't know yet. Let's build all the free spots first. Up another wave coming. F. Alright, I've built in every spot I can. If they get through at this point, then I pick the wrong towers. Nice. Fire rate improvement or firepower? I'm gonna take another firepower. Ooh, I just dealt I just got an achievement for dealing a shit ton of damage. Nice. And one right here. Okay, things are getting a little bit further than I would like them to get. Fortunately for me, I've run out of spots to build, so now I have to buy all my spots. Uh, I like that spot, too. Alright, I feel confident nothing's getting through here. 
169 of this essence. 187 of this essence. I am feeling very confident that this next shop is gonna really do good work for me. More shield damage or more fire rate? More fire power. I'll take a little extra shield damage. Ooh, it's forced me to take some antimatter scraps. Ooh, scandalous. Kinda glad I did. Okay, there we go. Now I feel more secure. Uh, one right there. And one right there. I like those spots. Those are good spots. I'm more afraid stuff's gonna get in over here because that's two paths are coming, are diverging, or converging into here. Although I don't think I should be worried. Nice. I'll take another I'll take another shot. Hopefully something impactful will uh, hopefully I'll get something impactful. Come on, where are you coming from first? Alright, there. Oh, they're coming from both sides. Shit. On, kill one of them. Thank you. Oh, thank goodness. I thought I had just killed myself there. Still not convinced I haven't. Okay, now I feel a lot better. How many tires do I have here? I got three there. All right. Build one more there, one more here. Okay. Now I'm no longer splitting defenses. I feel marginally better. Nothing can really get through me at this point. I think we've become too strong. All right, the big shop. So let's buy some antimatter, some extra shards. Oh. I'm not going to take the damage modifier. That screwed me over super hard last time. I'm going to skip it. Alright, so this guy now. I was really bored. You want to go further? A little, yeah. Show me what you're capable of. Okay, where's this first wave coming out of? I've got three down, that's enough. Let's see where he passes next. I will unlock primitively over here because when he builds there, that's basically gonna kill me. I will unlock that spot. Hopefully two towers there is enough. And it looks like it just barely is. Oh, wow, look it, I've already got him, like, almost dead. Wait, am I gonna win this? Dude, he's almost dead! The only way he can screw me over is if he comes up here next. Which he didn't. Oh my god, we won! Holy shit! Oh my god, is that my first run? Did we just win the first run? I just need to check what's behind the darkness. Guys, I've... I don't know if that's our first win or not. I've never gotten this far before. I'm assuming so. I'm assuming it's three stages, just because of the achievements I've seen. All worlds under control. Oh, that was it! That's our first W! That's awesome! I didn't even take damage on the last level.
So, now what? Wait, what? What's happening? I don't get it. What the hell just happened? Uh... Uh, I need an exposition dump. Everything turned out in a very unexpected way. Why the darkness... Why is the darkness suddenly so hard? However, cracks appeared after the collision, so all is not lost. Wait a second! Wait a second! So... I have to beat the game a few more times to force myself to whatever level four is. That's gotta be what's happening here. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Uh, let's go to the researches here. Unfortunately, that guy doesn't have anything for me. So uh, common enemies take 5% more damage. Awesome. And I'm gonna keep researching that one. Uh, the shop, is there anything spectacular? Not really. Um. I might just save my money for the next round, because there's some better upgrades we can get. So the slowing tower is definitely the key here. Uh, we can definitely make up the projectile speed. Not a problem. And the ninja... I think the ninja hat is is our key to victory here. So somebody at one point said, if I keep these in stock, I'll heal in between levels. I don't know if that's true or not, but... Man, we beat our first level. That's awesome! Oh, that's fantastic. I'm feeling pretty good about that. Well. That's that's outstanding. I'm super stoked by that. That's our first dub. Awesome. Well, a very exciting episode. It ended in a very unexpected way. Here me being kind of defeatist there at the beginning ended up in us taking a win. Uh, I think definitely taking that little bit of projectile speed... That little bit of radius and that overwhelming amount of damage certainly helped our chances at winning. Uh, if I were to go back and do this run all over again, I would say don't take the cheap tower caught or the cheap tower upgrade or the common tower upgrade. We can definitely do better than that. But that is all the time we have for today. When we come back next time, we'll see if we can't get our win number two. Thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode.